What is going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Spanko. Back at, I've got to slide over back at Emmett's over here. And I'm super excited. I haven't vlogged for you guys in such a long time. But it's a brand new format. Crossover Breakers just came out. I mean, we don't have a ban list, so it's technically not a new format. But we got a new set, which means new cards and a new deck. The best deck. Well, I think it's going to be the best deck moving forward, which is Ryzeal. Yes, we picked up Ryzeal. Well, technically, we're missing two cards. And we're going in there. And we're going to try to finish, get those last two cards. Because if I don't get those last two cards, can't actually play the deck. Hopefully, we can get those last two cards. But point is, we're playing Ryzeal today. And we're going to dominate locals. Because I haven't done one of these vlogs in a while. I want to show you guys the newest strategy that just came out in the Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG. And I've been loving this deck. Keep in mind, it's my first time playing it on paper. I've been playing it online. I've been testing. I learned the combos. We're going to see what happens. First time with these cards in hand, in person. Let's hope we can do good. So let's see what we can do. But with that being said, if you guys enjoy these videos, make sure to like and subscribe for more vlog content like this one. We also do product openings, combo videos, dual replays, all that good stuff. It's right here on the channel. You guys can also check out Spanko Duels where you guys get full duels in there, which I'm going to be recording as well today. So any of my vlog duels, it's going to be on that channel as well. With that said, though, I'm running late. Local starts in like three minutes. I mean, they never really start on time anyways, but I'm going to get in there, sign up, see if I can get those last two cards and get today started. Let's go. All right, we got some good news. We were able to get in and the boys had the cards I needed. So I finished my last two cards. It was just one Sword Rising and one Detonator. I got both cards. Deck is complete and we are ready to go. Now, I'm not gonna show you guys the list just yet. I will probably do that somewhere throughout the video. I think they're about to call round one. So I promise I'll get that profile for you guys. And I'll get a full deck profile with my explanation and everything soon. I'm not playing your standard list. I'm playing something like the main deck is a little bit standard. The extra is a little bit different, mostly because I'm missing some stuff, but also because I wanted to try some new things with the new format. That being said, yo, did you say round one was up? Yeah. Alright, who am I playing? Oh, space, baby, it's me and you. Let's get it. Feature match, baby. Alright, guys, round one, let's go. Harold? Yes, sir. Four, it's not very high. I didn't win a single dice roll last time I was here. So oh, you're gonna win one today. Five. Oh it's higher God. than me. <laughs> Uh, what do you like? I'll go first. You'll go first? You want to cut? Good luck, bro. Oh, that's an interesting... Okay. Unres? Yeah. Uh, draw? Yeah. Holy, the cold buy for the draw is crazy. <laughs> guys, we didn't pull through. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put you guys right here and talk to you guys real quick. So we just finished our round one. I ended up losing our round one. I'm actually just going to play a clip right here. And normal soul, 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 soul. Just get Soulbox? Yeah. Bro, I'm not going to lie. If I didn't have the Rizeal card, I would have been Yeah. Cool. Oh, you surprised when you were to play. Oh, shoot! Thinking. Thinking. Nuts. Nuts. I was never playing around Super Play. I'll tell you that much. And now that we're back from that clip, I just want to talk about how uh, that was good round one. It was fine. It was against my boy. But the thing is, I'm still kind of. I don't want to say I'm learning the rise. I actually don't think I played incorrectly. If you guys want to watch the full duel, it's going to be on the Spanko Duels channel. I am going to tell you guys this right now. I'm probably going to get myself on the feature match this entire day usually i like to get different media matches but the reason i want to do rise this entire day is because i actually want to watch back see how i can play better and just be a little bit you know just better in general as a player but the other thing is i don't think i misplayed my hand game one was just all engine i had a draw but then he had a call by for it and then my hand game two well game one lasted a while so my hand game two i ended on the uh, detonator but as you guys saw in the clip Super Poly actually just randomly came up, which I was never playing around Super Poly. I had the D barrier, but we ran into time and he had game one. So either way, he was going to get the round, which is fine, which is fine, guys. It happens. It happens to the best of us. I still think Ryzeal is an insane deck. It was either just A, a bad matchup, B, a bad hand, or C, all of the above, maybe. Maybe me misplaying. I don't know if I misplayed. Let me know in the comment section. You guys will probably see it on the dual channel. And I'm sure you guys are going to let me know I misplayed. But with that being said, let's get to round two. We're X1 technically first round, but if we just go X1 the rest of the day, um, we should still be good to go. So let's find out what we do in our round two. Let's go. Soon after. Hyrule? Yeah. Uh, I'll cut your deck actually first. Nine? Uh, Not bad. Six. I will go first. Okay, good luck. Good luck. Do lists. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so this honestly is looking a lot more like the test hands I was playing with, which is really good. That was my round two. I am actually really excited with that one. Oh my God, why am I all the way down low over here? Okay, cool. We actually ended up winning our round two. We took it two all. We were playing against Centurion Bistiel. That deck is actually still really good. And it actually, we were having conversation and it feels like Ryzeal is 
kind of plays like Centurion, if that makes sense. Like, it kind of does play like Centurion. It's very mid rangey. But the fact that Detonator is not a once per turn, like, he went wake up, and then I ended up going Detonator to pop the wake up. He chained Emblema because I knew, like, okay, if he has Emblema, he has Emblema. But the thing is, Detonator is not once per chain. So I'm like, all right, chain Detonator again, pop it. So uh, that was really good. Uh, game two, unfortunately, he actually kind of did brick. He opened three Bastille cards and, like, three Bastille cards. I just played around it because I would just keep sending the fire Ryzeal cards to the graveyard. So. Ended up taking that one too. Oh, we are one and one today so far. I think there's two more rounds. I'm not sure if there's one more or two more rounds. Sometimes they do three rounds, sometimes they do four rounds. I'm honestly not sure, but we'll see how the rest of the day goes. I'm excited though. This deck is very fun. I'm getting better. I can feel that I'm getting better with the deck. You guys are gonna see it again. Spangle Duels, check it out. I keep plugging it, but I want that channel to get to a thousand subs. So let's make that happen. With that being said though, let's get right into our round three. There's like two minutes left of this round. So I'm gonna set up and then we're gonna get right into it. Guys, look, 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 you looking pretty nice nowadays. Like, it's getting full. Emmett's is busy. I like that. We love to see it. Harold? Sure. Six. Okay, okay. There's a chance. I just don't know what you're oh. playing today. Five. Yeah. Thank you. I'm going to go first. All right, cool. It was $2 on release. It was like 20 I got them for $2. This hand's Ait. Uh, stand my main? Yep. Do I play into Bonfire? Into Bonfire. Into Droll here. I think I'm gonna play around it first. Okay, what I will start with is uh, I will special summon X Ryzeal, sending Aggregator. Effect on summon, I'm going to add Node. What's the special condition on Node? I uh, just have to control an Xyz monster on field or in graveyard, actually. I don't even have to control it. It has me. It can That's be great. crazy. I can just summon it right now. Yeah. We are X1 still. We won our last round, guys. So we're currently 2 and 1 today. Pretty good. We're playing up against Voices Voice, and uh, hand traps are good. You guys are going to see it in the duel, but uh, hand traps are really good. He drew a bunch of them, so he kind of stopped my plays, but because he drew a bunch of them, he couldn't really have a lot of plays of his own. In return, when he had plays, I had hand traps, so it was kind of like whatever, but my deck pushes harder. I remember I went dual drive, and I think he went mourner on dual drive. I was like, that's fine. I attack, because I, I, I tried to trade nothing on board, so I attack, and then, um, or he had one card on board, I can't remember, but I attack, whatever. And then follow up, he couldn't break my dual drive, so I was like, okay, cool, activate dual drive, search two, and then it was insane. And then the crazy part is he had, uh, there can be only one. Um, this is actually a really cool play. I'm actually gonna clip it right now. Activate dual drive, do you have Uh, Oh, wait, so this is the sorry. Okay, I'm actually taking the response. Oh, sure. Searching. I have to make sure the, the matching ones. So I can search a pipe. I can summon a pipe, right? Yes. Oh, yo, we're so cooking right now. We're so cooking right now. Ice? Yeah. Special X? Sure. Oh, send aggregator. Send aggregator? Yeah, target aggregator, target Yeah. Yeah, then I have game here, so I just go normal. Uh, yeah. Special summon, normal ice. That was my top. Yeah. It was like, yeah, no, no, that's so yeah, like when you go aggregator negating, there can only be one. Like that's absolutely insane. Floodgates. The fact that this deck beats floodgates just inherently is crazy, right? So we're currently two and one, and we have confirmed that there is four rounds today. So there's gonna be one more round. We just gotta go X one to finish the day, and hopefully we can get top and get some good prizing. I'm not sure what the prizing is gonna be like at X one, but it's fine. It's fine. It's my first time on the deck in real life, anyways, and I'm having a really good time with it. So uh, we have 19 minutes. Actually, the time is right here. We have 19 minutes, which means I can show you guys a quick deck profile. All right, guys, I want to show you guys a quick like run through of the deck i'm pretty much playing a standard just pure riseo build i'm playing one of this just for cross out but i typically side it out but one plug in two cross three x you know the standard stuff when the seventh stuff comes out that's going to be swapped out i mean bonfire is still good right but seven stuff is really good i love this card i think this card is absolutely insane plasma hole over here so there's nothing really super special with my main deck I think with the extra deck is where it kind of gets funny because um, I don't have certain cards. Obviously, double dual drive, double detonator, X taunt, tornado dragon. Like this is pretty standard stuff that you guys are gonna see. But I don't have a typhon, so like I'm not playing typhon in here. I'm also playing this because I think this card is spicy. First of all, the plasma card, the, the Rizeal plasma hole, is a whole card, so you can actually send it with Rafasia. That doesn't really come up, but my side deck though, I want to show you guys my side deck over here. I'm playing the one Grave Digger Trap Hole, and I think that's really good into today's format as well because it also negates banish monster effects. That's good into Malice, so I sided in cards like d barrier thrust for d barrier harpies lancia for malice and then the mulch armies of course so i mean the deck's cool i just um again like i just don't have certain things i'm not playing the photon rank four guy i feel like it never actually comes up you never actually make it so i don't think it makes sense to play it i think i, I play cowboy which is should be the typhon spot but i thought that i'd be going into time more often i never went into time so 
I maybe should have. I mean, I went at the time um, round one, but I think he had like all the stops anyway, so I couldn't go into Cowboy. So, you know, it is what it is. I, I feel like I like this extra deck. I don't have a problem with it really. But that's really it for the deck. I think this deck is quite standard. I hate Desires. I think Desires is such a bad card, but unfortunately, right now, you still got to play Desires. Or just playing a bunch of hand traps, baby. Eventually. Hello? Yes, sir. Six, not very high. Six, oh, that's save me. Three, that's the worst. Seven. What do you want? I'll start. All right, good luck, homie. Good luck. Yeah, you're good. So, yo, we just finished our fourth round and we ended up winning in two games, which is crazy. So we are X1, which means we do top. But I think the most important thing that I actually want to talk about, the match was fun. It's fair. It's going to be on Spangled Duels. I ended up winning. It was against Mermail. Great deck, great player. But today is the day of YCS Anaheim, the finals. It's Sunday, okay? And they just announced, and by the time you guys are seeing this, it's probably going to be announced. It's going to be old news. But they just announced that uh, there's going to be a ban list announced right after the final match of YCS Anaheim. Which means, I don't know what round we're in and why I I'm going to take a look. If it's like right now, I'm going to do a live reaction with the whole boys. If not, then I'm probably going to go home and film a separate bandless reaction video because you know how those are. But still, crazy. The fact that they're announcing, well, it, I think that's a really good method. Konami, if you're watching this, I agree with this. After YCS, after a major YCS, announce it right after, right? So I think that's really cool. But that's got us really hyped right now. The entire locals is insanely hyped right now. So we're going to see what the ban list is like and we're going to see if Ryzeal ends up actually being the best deck because. We went X1 today, round one was kind of unfortunate. XO the rest of the way, right? So thank you guys all for watching. I don't want to end the video just yet. So we're going to figure out what's happening with the ban list. And either I do a ban list react in this video or I do a ban list react in the next video. But uh, well, let's not be in the next video because I guess you'll get the reaction before this video goes out. We'll see, but we're X1, baby. Let's see what we end on. Hopefully second, maybe maybe it's going to be third, depending. Let's see what the prizing is like and we'll go from there. So I just confirmed that the uh, YCS Anaheim is still in the round of 16, so top 16. So there's still a little bit of time before the y before the ban list is going to be announced. At this point, you guys have already seen it because the video is coming out after the ban list. But uh, I'm going to go home then. I'm going to wait for my results. And I'm going to go home so I can do a ban list reaction video for you guys. We all know how much views ban list reaction videos get, so that's going to be crazy. Good day. Let's just wait for the final results and then I'm going to show you guys and then we'll end off the video. Thank you guys. All right, well, on the bright side, guys, we ended up coming second place today. Lot in the mirror right there, second place with nine points. I didn't even end up playing the first place guy today, but that was pretty good though. I'm not gonna lie, that's that's pretty good. Time to go home though, cause ban list time. So guys, with that said, we're hopping into the car right now. We're headed home, cause there's a ban list reaction we gotta do. But thank you guys all for watching. I don't typically end vlogs off like this because there's typically not a ban list that's announced when it's gonna happen during these vlogs. But thank you guys all for watching. I appreciate every single one of you. I learned a lot about Ryzeal today. I think that deck is really strong. I'm very happy with my performance. I could tell that I was getting better throughout the day, which I really, really like. Cause you know, as I was playing more, I was like, okay, I understand these cards. I understand what they do. So that's kind of where I was at. Like I was like, you know what? I knew what the cards did already. And I already had some practice on it beforehand, but then playing them in real life is completely different. And I think I got a really good feel, especially by the end of the tournament, being able to 2-0 our last two opponents just goes to show that like, I'm starting to play better, trying to play smarter, just really Really understanding what my opponent's cards do as well so that i can hand trap correctly use detonator correctly actually i'm pretty sure i 2 would all of my opponents after round one yeah like i literally went undefeated i only lost one game in round one because technically we went to the time and then i went six and all after that so you know good day though i'm happy I think Ryzeal is going to be one of the best decks. By the time you guys are watching this, there's already going to be a ban list. So it'll pretty much confirm if Ryzeal is the best deck or not in a little bit. So yeah, I got to get home. got to film that reaction video and I got to start working on some deck profiles for you guys. So thank you guys all for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe if you guys did enjoy today's video. Again, I keep plugging in, but make sure to check out the Spanko Duels channel. All my duels, I filmed only myself today. So all my duels are there. You guys watch me misplay. I know you guys are going to let me know anyways, but I'm going to watch it back. And and this is, I actually made a misplay against the Mermel player and it didn't matter at the end, but I'm happy I get to film it because now i'm gonna watch it back and go okay don't make that mistake again because that's gonna potentially bite you in the butt later i don't know what the saying is but you know what i'm saying so thank you guys all for watching i appreciate every single one of you with that Svenkos, i don't know Jeez.